Hey everyone, welcome to today's live stream. Uh, so this is an energy reading, a healing, a transformation where we're tuning, in, tuning into the energy that's coming in through us and for us and that's showing up within us to help us to, to move through this whole experience that we're all having all around the world in a way that feels most aligned for us and most in flow for us. Um, so my name is Janine Thorpe, if you, if you don't know me already, and I help people to tune into and read energy so that they can help themselves and also help others more. Um, so we're going to use again the same couple of essence sets that, that we have been using. Something else might come in as well, we'll go with, <laughs> we'll go with what comes in, but uh, we'll use them. And we don't need essences. We can we can just tune into the energy that's coming in, you know, through us. It's it's just you know we have instant access to it. But the essences can make it easier for us a lot of the time. Um, you know, it's a little bit like an essential oil or a homeopathic remedy or something. It's already got the energies of the plants grounded <laughs> in physical form, and it makes it easier to connect with. And the essences here are they are, are similar. So let's see what comes in. Okay, so do you want to just take a moment to to feel into your your body and your energy, how you're feel how you're feeling in your emotions, any thoughts and so on that are going on for you, that are coming up for you, and just just see how you are right now in this moment. And connect and acknowledge whatever it is that's going on for you right now. Um, so it's a little bit like just recognizing yourself, recognizing the parts of you that maybe are in fear or anxiety or in stress or in struggle and saying, I acknowledge you, I'm here for you and let's, let's work with this, let's work through this together. <laughs> so it's been really kind to yourself. Okay, and, and then if you want to give permission for these essences and energies to come in for you in whatever way is right for you, if, if that's what feels right, Okay, all right. So it looks like there's just something else that's coming in before we start with the essences. Do you want to feel into what you would love? How would you love to be feeling? What would you love to be experiencing? Um, what would you love to see happening or experience happening in the world around you? Just feel into that for a moment. And yeah, again, just feel how, how you feel about that in yourself. All right, and now feel your weight on the chair, your feet on the ground. Yeah, your connection with the earth. Imagine that your energy or feel into your energy field being really wide. So just feel into the, the whole width of your aura. And most of the time our aura or energy field is much wider than we, <laughs> than we realize it is. So imagine, oh, thank you. <laughs> So imagine that your aura is actually quite extended and that your intention is to fill into your aura. So your intention is to, that you want to take up your whole auric field. Okay, because the more fully we're in our auric field, in our energy field, the stronger we are, the more resilient we are. And the more we can be uh, in, a, in, a, in a good place in ourselves. Okay. All right, okay, so now one of the essences is coming in. So this is an essence from the Alignment Essence set. So this is the Reversal Release Essence that's coming in now at the moment. Um, and hi, everybody <laughs> who's joining. So the Reversal Release Essence helps to release the places where we kind of have trauma experience, either to do with what's going on now or from the past. Um, and also helping to release where we've gone into um, faint. Hi, Ruth. <laughs> Welcome. Oh, hi. I think that was Carol. Welcome. <laughs> um, so you know the way when we go into our, our nervous system can be in fight, flight, freeze or faint. Um, so this reverse release essence as well as releasing so the places where we're kind of going in reverse. Um, it also helps to release the freeze and faint responses, so where we're feeling paralyzed or where we're feeling like just being unconscious, just we'll be unconscious is like that's just our, our nervous system response. Thank you for the hearts. <laughs> um, 
which is probably coming up for a lot of people at this time. It's like, it's because there's so much change and there's so much to adapt to and to adjust to. So if you want to just give permission for this reversal release essence to come in for you. Um, hi, <laughs> welcome. And um, yeah, just give permission for this reversal release essence to come in. And what's happening is if you want to feel into your energy and just see what's going on in the energy. So to me, it looks like there's an unlocking happening in your system. So sometimes when we go into that freeze or faint or we go into that trauma space, we kind of lock, lock our energy locks, if you like, and we can't move. We can't do anything really. We can't really function very well. So what is happening with this essence is that softening, it's opening up. Um, it's like the energy can flow within us. Okay, so if you want to feel that in your body and your energy, to me it feels like there are lots of sort of tingles flowing through our legs or through your legs uh, and up through into your tummy. It's like, yeah, I just feel all this sort of, um, it's almost like an electrical current running through the um, the whole of your energy field. Okay, and then once that unlocking happens, uh, the energy is flowing and it feels like there's another essence coming in now. So this is an essence called realigning with your soul's blueprint. So this helps us to realign with the, it's like the, the blueprint for being human <laughs> for being our true self in human form so our our soul if you like our spirit um has come in you know we've chosen a body we've chosen an experience we've chosen all sorts of different things and it's like there's like an architect has a plan for building a house it's a little bit like we've got a blueprint you know and all sorts of things can happen within that blueprint but that there is a blueprint and sometimes we can be due to life experiences we can disconnect from that blueprint or we can close it down or we can just could have shut off from it. <laughs> ah, thanks for the hearts. <laughs> and so with this essence, the it's like we're rediscovering our true selves. Um, so there's a sense of letting go of anything that maybe is false or anything that's uh, like a pretense or anything that is kind of maybe masks or different things that we've put up as a way to cope with life. So there's a sense of releasing the, these and with that then there's a feeling of ease and relaxation coming in. So if you want to feel into your body again, I can feel quite a lot going on around the whole tummy area. It's quite a lot of emotional stuff going on um, because I suppose part of not being true to ourselves is like self-abandonment, you know, that we did because that was sort of the best we knew at the time and so there's a sense of really honouring that. <laughs> Um, and at the same time, it can be quite emotional because there was that sort of shutting away part of ourselves. Okay, so if you want to feel into your legs, again, I can feel, I feel sort of like this shaking in our legs and almost like a like fear in our legs that's kind of going, oh, I don't know if it's okay to be me. And so if you want to feel into your legs, feel into your knees, your, your ankles, your feet, and just give yourself permission that, that it's okay to be true to yourself. It's okay to be true to yourself and to be your true self. Okay, and okay, and just breathe. So again, I can feel going on, kind of in, 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 in you know, our energy fields, there's a, there is that sense of reconnecting with, with our blueprint. It's like all these little lights are switching on in our energy field is what it looks like. Okay, all right. Um, all right, so if you want to again, feel into or think about what's going on for you at the moment in life. What are your challenges, um, both in practical terms as well as emotional or energetic terms? Okay, and just ask your energy, what do I need? What do I need to support myself right now? And we'll just see what comes in. Okay. All right, so you might get a sense of something or you might not, but either way, just by asking that question, you kind of opened up something to come in for you. And the essence that's coming in is uh, from the Earthlight set, which is life transformation. I know this has come in a few times, hasn't it? <laughs> so this is the one that brings in a quantum shift and supports a quantum shift, um, <clears throat> which is so relevant <laughs> for this time. Okay, so you want to just breathe. 
Notice how you're feeling. Okay. So I'm getting an image of kind of that, you know, like we're looking at a TV screen or a computer screen. <laughs> um, and there's a certain film playing. And it looks like, it's almost like that is changing. I see all this kind of, um, like maybe static coming in or changes happening in the film that we're seeing. It's like, Ju -ju -ju. Yeah, so it's like the picture is changing on the film. And as it's changing and different pictures coming up are starting to come in, it's like they're not coming in completely, but they're starting to come in. Um, there's a feeling of relief. It's almost like we're going, oh, thank goodness, I can, there's a, di there's a different film coming in. I'm starting to see a different film. I'm starting to have a, a different, um, maybe relationship to the world or a different sense of, uh, what, what what you're seeing, what you're perceiving. Okay, and just notice how you're feeling as I'm describing this image. And notice how you're feeling in yourself. Does it feel, do you feel a relief? Do you feel, um, or do you feel the opposite? Do you feel a closing down? Just notice how you're feeling. To me, it feels like a relief. It feels like a letting go. It feels like everything's going to be okay. There's a sense of, um, of forward movement so it's like we're we're opening up this space for moving forwards towards something that's better and it's almost like the earlier film that we were watching was kind of keeping us in the old energy in this analogy <laughs> it's keeping us in the old energy and as we're allowing now this new film if you like to come in um it's like yeah it's like we're literally opening up to a new reality that's coming in and that feels really good it feels like there's a lot more balance with nature it looks like there's a lot more um honoring of what it is that is really relevant for us all okay all right how are you feeling now <laughs> i hope this is resonating <laughs> Uh, all right, if you were to, um, no, I won't stand up now, but if you feel like standing up or you could do the sitting down, if you want to sort of just move your legs, move your feet, um, it's completing what we're doing here today is completing and just, and feel into your energy. So, um, yeah, as you're moving your feet and your legs, it's helping to integrate the shifts that have been going on and you might want to roll your shoulders or maybe just roll your neck a little maybe stretch and feel out into your wider energy field and have a sense of having a really wide energy field and really sort of balanced stable uh, flowing dynamic energy field um, so you're really acknowledging it and, and, and affirming it okay all right okay so there's something coming in now to share with the with the wider world so um, all right, so this isn't an essence yet. <laughs> so if you want to just put your attention on the wider world, on the people who are ill, the people who are um, supporting those who are ill, the people who are supporting, so that, you know, the medical people and everybody connected with, with supporting the people who are ill. Um, also the people who are supporting us by having shops open, you know, retail people who are keeping the food supply and essential supply open um the people who are who are you know growing the food you know everybody who is supporting us as a global community um the people in your community in your family all the people it's like we're all doing our part in whatever way is right for us at this time and who wants to just notice and appreciate everybody like send um thanks and gratitude to everybody all right, okay, and as, as we're doing this, the essence called Emotion Balancer is coming in now. And to me, it feels really emotional. It's almost like, I don't know, this is this gratitude. It just had, there's just a feeling of, yeah, a lot of them, a lot of different emotions coming in. Um, so if you want to just feel whoever you're feeling as you have the sense of appreciation for the whole, everybody really in the world. And the co-creative, collaborative experience that we're, in or moving towards and including to to anybody who's not feeling that who's feeling like they have to fight their corner or um that they're the only ones who are going to take care of themselves everybody who's feeling that sense of being alone within it also have a sense of of, of love and, and and gratitude for them okay 
All right, and just notice how you're feeling. So this emotion balance in essence is, uh, it's almost like it's opening up channels for us to receive. So there's quite a flow coming through and there's a sense of flow. It's almost like flowing through us and out into the world around us and out into the community and to people and distance and time is irrelevant. Um, it's, it doesn't matter whether it's somebody right beside you or somebody, you know, on the other side of the world. Uh, um, and it doesn't matter whether it's right now or whether it's, you know, some other time. <laughs> There's that sense of this flow between all people. Okay, so that feels like it's sort of settling in some way. Um, okay, and the relationship essence is coming in as well. This feels like the, the last one. So the relationship essence is coming in because, of course, you know, people connections are all about relationships, uh, including our relationship with ourselves. So there's a feeling of there's a healing coming in around our relationship with herself and with others. Oh, um, <laughs> I'm getting a picture of all these sort of like little, little and again it's a it's a, a symbolic picture. It's like all these little hearts kind of pumping in our energy field. It's just this lovely heart energy is just um, pumping and it feels really really light as well. So okay, all right, that feels like it's completing. I hope. I hope everybody is doing okay. Uh, I'll be here again tomorrow at the same time. Um, there's a sense that what we're doing here and you know, whether you're joining every time live or in the replay or whether you're just dipping in now and again, there's a sense of something, <coughs> something bigger going on. <laughs> and there's my throat, my voice goes. <laughs> there's something bigger going on that we are collectively uh, contributing to by, by showing up in this way. I get the, you know, I get the image of um, like so many beings, non-physical beings and physical beings all working together to create this change and this evolution and this transformation in consciousness and in human everyday life, um, physical, practical life. And what we're doing is, is a part of that and what loads of people are doing is part of that. So there's this huge collaborative <laughs> experience that's going on that feels really, really good. So thank you so much for being a part of it. Um, I know we're all doing lots of different things that are part of it. So and thank you for the hearts. <laughs> okay. Um, well, I will see you tomorrow and have a good day. Stay well, stay safe and big hugs for you all. Okay. Take care. Bye. Oh, and if anybody wants us to say any comments, just, uh, just uh, feel free to do that. And also, if you know anybody who is, who you think might be interested in this, um, please share it. Please share it so we can spread it. Okay, bye. Thank you.